Hey y'all, welcome to Anisha L TV. I am Anisha L and today is vlog number three. Go Puff vlog number three. Possibly part one. I'm not sure if I'm gonna break it up into parts or not. But I'm on my way to time now. I have a time of 9.58. So I am running a tad bit behind because I was trying to upload a video. <laughs> and it just wasn't working the way I needed it to work so time got away from me so got to do better with my time management I don't know what possessed me to edit and upload a video but I was woke couldn't sleep so I just figured I would do that you know what I'm saying but anyway it's 9.59 now supposed to be there at 10 o'clock I signed on to be there at 10 o'clock but I get there it don't pay to run late because everybody named mama want to drive you know like a turtle so it's best to just you know leave a few minutes early or you face the chances of being delayed even more Just paying attention kind of paying attention to the road I don't want no problems all right it's 10 a.m. on the dot driver behind me I'm about to pull up the go drive app which is the app that you sign on when you are about to prepare for your day's duty so this is what it looked like yards street so I should be able to just sign on it might be hating on me say oh you ain't close enough like they did yesterday I just swipe and it's yeah they're saying I'm right here by it and it won't let me on ain't that weird Ugh. cool 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 whatever Right here. Let's try it again. Oh, I guess it let me on now. Good. Had to do my little turn around. confirmed this alcohol I might get an alcohol order I don't particularly want one people say that you get you definitely get tips when you deliver alcohol to people I don't know that to be true but I did I mean I did deliver my first alcohol beverage on my first day and I did get a, a 
tip so it could be it could be true I'm not for sure so my schedule today I was original originally uh, do the work um, 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. and then uh, um, a slot came available I guess somebody dropped their slot big up to them and I picked up uh, 2 to 6 so I'll be working from 10 to 6 with that hour break in between I guess I'll use that for lunch time uh, and also yesterday um, I received a couple orders that had um, frozen items so I figured today I would just bring me um, one of those uh, cool cooler type bags so that I can if I get something else today or any other day from here on I can just put it in there so when they get their stuff it should still be in the condition that it was when it left the, the warehouse because I wouldn't want to place an order for something frozen and then when I get it it's thawed out if I wasn't intending on using it right away so yeah I think I'll be doing maybe two out every two hours doing a check-in the time now is 10.04 and so far I haven't received the order So I guess I'll do a check in at 10, 10, at um, 12, 12 o'clock or so. Bye. Hi y'all. It is almost 12 o'clock. I figured I'd jump on here just a little earlier, just in case when I reach back to the Gold Puff yard, if I have a delivery, I wanna be able to give an update while I'm en route to to the facility Whew. so far I don't have any new deliveries let me tell you I have been jumping since 10 11 Woo. my last delivery was a double delivery they really breaking your girl in today I had two bags going to two different places. Like I'm like, what am I supposed to do? And I ain't really seen nobody on <laughs> on here explain how you do a double delivery. I've seen a lot of YouTubers who deliver for GoPuff have more than one delivery, but they never like went into detail about how they drop it off. So I got I got uh thrown into that today <laughs> I also had an ID drop off uh, this person had like a lighter and you know some of some of the stuff that you use to get cool with so yeah they was you know have plans on getting cool later on or something like yeah tobacco tobacco products <laughs> But it wasn't going to be tobacco, I tell you that. Anyway, I digress. <laughs> Alright, so. So far, I've had five deliveries. Five. Now I get to look decompress. I think that's the word I want to use <laughs> for, for a moment. So I'm pulling up to the GoPuff facility, the yard, and so far my bell ain't rang, and it looked like it's at least a driver or two ahead of me, so uh, I guess I can catch my breath momentarily. Ugh, Father, give me strength, give me strength and, and help to ease my spirits, because I am... I'm like, ugh, my adrenaline is really flowing today, boy, I tell you. Alright, so I had five deliveries, and out of the five deliveries, four customers tipped me. 
my first delivery was um, at 10 11 my tip was five dollars and 99 cent my second delivery was at 10 42 um, I got tip two dollars and 99 cent my third delivery which was the tobacco products and lighter drop off I got tip 50 cent <laughs> My fourth delivery when I get anything and the delivery I just came from which was the fifth one I received four dollars and ninety nine cents as my tip <laughs> I'm puffing puffing the day like jeez I, oh, I can't catch my breath Ugh, get it together ooh come on center yourself you got some you got to talk to yourself sometimes you got to talk to yourself to get your man your inner man uh, in order get them get them back on square so that's what I'm doing so okay so my last order if anybody who delivers for GoPuff and watches this video I would love for you to tell me if you've experienced this my phone my cellular device it froze right in the middle of me about to take a picture and I'm like what the hell so I'm assuming when this happens you your order isn't complete because your customer hasn't received the picture to let them know that you are here with their stuff or whatever the case is the um, customer said the call so I did I called them before my phone froze to let him know that I was outside and he was just like leave it <laughs> it's like an apartment building with a, a buzzer so security basically that's what I'm saying the secure building and he just said leave it at outside I ain't feel right with it but hey he said leave it outside my phone had froze I'm like what I'm gonna do I just ran and I went and got my camera and I took a picture with my camera just in case because um, I didn't know what the hell my phone was going to do if it was going to send me where it was going to send me after it um, froze so I just I took a picture with my phone uh, with my um, camera my Canon camera I don't know what good that was going to do but I sure did it <sighs> and it, it happened to me um, yesterday as well I'm like it's, does it have something to do with the with the GoPuff app if it is the app that's freezing my phone but I don't I don't like that feeling whatsoever because I don't want to look incompetent you know especially when the person um, gave me five bucks like come on girl I didn't get you like five bucks I'm gonna need you to do do right but anyway when my phone unfroze I, I just sat sat at the customers um, residence outside the residence trying to figure out what the was going on with my cellular device and it unfroze itself and I was able to complete the order I I went back out and took a picture of, of it at the doorway and sent it to the customer and then um, also text the customer with the picture of it outside let them know that my phone had froze and that I really appreciated them using GoPuff and that's how that went so the time is now exactly 12 o'clock so I've been I've been busy out here in these puffy streets getting getting this puffy money <laughs> so please again any go puff drivers please let me know like if, if it's just me I have an Apple phone I don't know if it got something to do with Apple or or what but that joint froze up and I was like oh shucks what I'm gonna do So that kind of had me on edge. I kid, I kid you not. So I wanted to also say how I got really got into GoPuff was like, okay, I needed some some income coming in, and I've been seeing all these different YouTube videos of drivers doing um, GoPuff but one particular uh, youtuber 
Mr. Rookie Rich. He is um, in Michigan, but he's from Cleveland. Go Cleveland! Uh, he is how I really like just jump full force into it. So thank you, Mr. Rookie Rich, uh, for all your wonderful videos that really helped me to make up my mind that I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try this Go Puff thing. Check out his channel. I will leave his info down below. He is a very, 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 what's the word I want to use? Humble. He's a very humble, knowledgeable, um, approachable. Just from his YouTube videos, I gather all these um, accolades that I just listed, and there are more, but my mind is still not quite where it needs to be to really give him the kudos that he deserves. But um, he's po he's very positive. He does a lot of things um, outside of GoPuff. So he does GoPuff, he does Walmart Spark, he does eBay. Um, he has eBay an eBay store. Um, he's into stocks. Uh, that's just to name a few of the things that he does. So it would probably be a great, great idea to check out his um, channel. And again, I will leave it down in the description box below. So check him out and tell him Anisha LTV sent you. Okay, and get you some of this positivity that this man is throwing out there because he is on. He's like on 10, but he's really on 100. <laughs> okay, so I guess I'm going to get back at you at 2 o'clock. Or if anything exciting happens, maybe I'll come back a little earlier. But I'm trying to figure out how to make my videos a little shorter. Because <laughs> they've been like long 40 minutes 30 minutes and a lot of people have short attention spans so i'm you know i'm just i'm, I'm trying and again i'll be back at two o'clock or if you know something very 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 exciting happens hey y'all i am back it is 205 i guess i was supposed to have like a break from one to two but i didn't really take no break for real I just went to the little go puff place and I just was there uh, and so now I got a, I got a, uh, a order number what is this order delivery number eight it's pretty much just a uh, I'm only getting the delivery fee because I wasn't inside the block. And I'm okay with that because I'm all I was already already there. So that just be three dollars and seventy five cent added on to what I'm making. Uh but ordinarily I would not show up to go puff outside of a block because I need that uh ten dollars and fifty cents an hour that they give the drivers who are on the schedule I don't know the correct terminology for it but whatever it's called that's what I need so ordinarily I wouldn't just pop up at you no know, go puff and be puffing away just for some delivery tips delivery fees and potentially potentially not getting a tip uh, so now I'm going back to the facility to start the two to six block schedule. And I'm already um, at 17 orders inside the block. Because if I'm not mistaken, if you if you outside of the block, those those deliveries don't count towards the weekly reward. Those orders don't count towards the weekly rewards. So I apologize for my shaky camera. This little bootleg, I 
I guess. But I'm making it do what it do. So let me reiterate. The weekly reward, if, if it's inside the, it's got to be inside the, the block. So you got to be scheduled in order to get the weekly reward, if I am correct. So far as inside the block, I have 17, but I also have a total of 18 because I did this last one outside the block. I probably said a whole lot of nothing. But anyway, so the weekly reward that I'm close to getting is 20, you get 20 drop offs or 20 deliveries, you get $28 as your weekly reward so I have 17 and I don't get off until 6 so I should get that weekly weekly reward of 28 bucks pulling into the lineup baby it look like it's like mm, not counting me it's one two three four Four drivers, if you count me, five in line to get a delivery. So I presume I'll jump back on here at four, which will be two hours or 409, somewhere in there. All right, see you at four ish. Hey y'all, I'm back. It's 409. I just came back from my 10th delivery and I received two dollars and ninety nine cents for that one since 209 I've only had two trips I've received a total of six tips <sighs> so this last half has been a little slow but I'm I'm not complaining because I've been humping today I got I don't got 10 orders today I think I might have received my weekly reward I think but I'm not sure because that one I did, it was off of the scheduled block. So I know for sure if I get one more order that I know 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 that I got my weekly bonus. I shall be back at six o'clock when it's time to clock out unless something amazing happens and I jump back on here. Hey y'all, I am back. It is now 6.02 and my day is done. I have signed out of GoPuff. I'll probably just show a little video of what I, what I did. You probably don't care, but somebody might. <laughs> okay, signed out of, signed out. I'll go back tomorrow at 7 p.m. 7 to 10 tomorrow. Um, today, I was going crazy. I, man, I don't know if you can see all of that. Usually, I move the phone so fast that so you can't even read what the heck was there. If, anyways, I'll probably just include it right in front of it, nonetheless. So, I got a total of 14 deliveries today so I received um, $52 and 50 cent in delivery fees and I received $42 and 44 cent in tips coming to a total of $94 and 94 cent I'm not for sure if my bonus my bonus can't be included in that I don't know when they gonna uh, include the weekly reward but I hit um, 20 I surpassed 20 deliveries by four so since I got 20 plus deliveries I received a 28 dollar reward I'll tell you like man my last two no I apologize my second to last two deliveries 
were a double delivery so it was my second time getting a double delivery so apparently that's a thing like some people get probably i've seen people get six bags um as far as watching them on youtube seeing youtubers who do go puff get um you know multiple deliveries at once so apparently that's a thing i was i was nervous i'm not gonna hold you this is like okay i got two orders i just don't want to i don't want to mess nothing up and both of those orders um tipped me one tipped me um five dollars and the other one tipped me five dollars and 79 cents i'm like this was uh, yes uh I, today i had a couple um orders where it was either alcohol or tobacco fire type deliveries and all of those orders is a little rickety so the camera is moving more than normal Ugh. all right I had to just get stationary um, because that camera was just bopping around a little too much so as I was trying to say is I had several orders today where it was an alcoholic beverage or tobacco um, and fire type deliveries and all of those when I say all all of those deliveries tipped me mm. so I'm just like so it must be true that when you get alcoholic beverages or when you get yeah when you get alcoholic beverage deliveries they it's a high percentage that you'll get a tip from them so I don't really go I don't go into it expecting a tip uh, but it's nice it is so nice to receive one for for real it make those numbers add up the pay you make that and make that pay add up uh, so I am going to end my vlog here I'm still getting used to this go puff um, thing I'm a little chill right now but I was a little on edge when I got that double delivery but I'm 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 simmering down now but if you like what I do here on my channel I Anisha L would love for you to like comment respectfully subscribe and once you subscribe Hit that notification bell so that you will be up to date on when I drop new content. Until next time, I appreciate you. Later.